Hi, my name is Heather Johnston and I have been volunteering with the Coast to Coast Foundation for two years now and I got involved through Chris. My name is Christopher Kane. Uh, I'm a planner with Investors Group and I have been involved for three years. Uh, I got involved when uh, a division director, my division director introduced me to the cause and, and what the foundation did and I ended up speaking with one of the founding members and it's, uh, it's just been uh, a steady roll from there. I'm glad to be involved and I'm glad to know the people that, I, that I've got to know through the foundation. I really firmly believe that the more you give, the, the more that will eventually come back to you. And it, it, it really, it, this particular cause, you know, the, a foundation that helps children with cancer is such an amazing thing and they give 100% of all the, the proceeds to the cause to help the kids. And, you know, Heather and I try to get involved throughout the year, not just in August, through um, inside rides, a 24-hour spin, um, volunteering to help set up and tear down at different events, and, and we organize our own inside ride event uh, as much as we can, whenever we can, just because it's such a fantastic uh, cause and, and foundation. Yeah. As Canadians, we're, we're all very busy. We have our family, our friends, and you know, work, and so on and so forth, but if you look outside of yourself, and try to find a little bit of time to, to donate for, for something meaningful like this, uh, it'll, it'll really come back to you in, in energy. And the, the positive energy that you get from something like this is, is, is worth tenfold the amount of time that you put into it. I think it's really amazing. I, I find it quite rewarding and um, I was actually just saying to someone earlier that uh, there's many opportunities to get involved with the charity and some of them are, are, are quite involved and some of them aren't. And there's a lot of um, a lot of events that you can choose from that fit your own lifestyle and your own time schedule and allow you to touch the lives of people without necessarily having to commit too much. Um, so it's, it's easy. They make it very easy for you to do that and, and it's rewarding and it's fun. And the more you get involved, the more you start to meet the same people and it's like we're a family and that's also a really good feeling. Yeah, you get a really good sense of community with the, the group that does these great things. When you're away on tour for kids in August, you know, each night there's one of the ambassador children or somebody from one of the camps or someone that's, you know, giving a talk. And, you know, as much fun as the ride is, hearing the, uh, the people from the camps and the people who have benefited from those organizations and events, um, the ambassador families that come to talk, it, it really touches you and puts it all into perspective and helps us really remember why we do this. And uh, uh, one fella in particular, his name's Brandon Strawn, came to our, our first inside ride at the Caledon Golf and Country Club and uh, he had a form of brain cancer when he was young and uh, you know he was fortunate enough to uh, fight through that with the help of his family, friends and, and the foundation and, and he's, he's an inspiration because it doesn't affect him at all. He's a really outgoing kid in spite of everything he's been through and it, it's just amazing to see. Uh, I said this at Tour for Kids this year. I think that, that working with and getting to know Stephen and Jeff and Laurie O'Hara and um, Jen Davies and uh, Larry Optus even and uh, Michael Sharp, you know, all the, the members of the core team and the founders. The, the positive energy and, and the non-stop uh, effort that they put in to this. When, when I see what those people do, it, it, I feel like it makes me a better person because it makes me want to try harder and give more and do more. You know, it makes me a better version of me to, to know those people. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I, I think it's a, a privilege that, that I'm able to, to know those folks. Yep.